welcome back to Project Zomboid. It's a rainy day outside. So I think that could be a good time to read some books. We've got a lot of books to read. Various things. Let's start off with the ones we really, really like to have. Like first aid, maybe tailoring. Just all the volume one ones effectively. I'm gonna have the first aid book here. How about Taylor, I guess. And we're going to use the fancy snazzy speeding up time to get through this more quickly. A bit peckish, that's alright. Let us continue reading the first aid book. Starting at 31 pages. But quicker. Time is going to be blasting through here. Well, at least it speeds this up a bit. We will get hungry more quickly also. Which is another thing to consider. What is this? Three times speed? I'll be regular, faster, and faster. So, definitely very quick. Getting bored of reading our book. Look, reading it quickly here. We're not gonna like starve or anything. We will read our book and then slow down time and deal with how things are going. Regular speed. Okay. Well, that completes the first aid book. Now we're getting the three times XP multiplier. Lovely. Then the used book's chest. Have something to eat here. Have a grapefruit. It's very thirst quenching, which is also nice. See how that does for us. A little bit less hungry. <laughs> yeah, good enough. Start reading the Taylor book. Speed of time. <laughs> We got a lot of books to read. It's gonna be worth it. We might end up just not worrying about other stuff. Read a book, read a book, read a book. <laughs> Whether or not it's the best idea to just read all the books, probably just read the ones that are important and useful. Well, that's something. It's getting a bit late. It's not tired though. Our sleep schedule is getting a little bit off, so I might want to fix that, honestly. Finish reading this book. Go to sleep. You have a snack and then go to sleep. Okay. This is after midnight again here. Probably is better to be looking around outside when it is daytime. Stuff's going stale. Muffin's only seven. Eat a burrito. Eat like half a burrito. Should be fine. Go also check to see how our injuries are doing here. Let's get some sleep first. It's very dark in here. Better for sleeping, I suppose. Sorry. Get back on a regular kind of time frame here. 6 a.m.? Eh, decent. Technically, we don't know if it's a hammer p.m. because the watch does not have that information. Well, that's okay. Let's grab some more books to read. We'll take cooking. Eventually we're going to want carpentry too. That would also be helpful. Let's grab metalworking. So I want to do some metalworking. It looks like we can pretty much read... I just want to go into the bandages first. We might end up needing some disinfectants. So we'll grab an alcohol wipe. 
Remove the bandage on the hand. See how things are going. Fine. And remove the bandage from the forearm. Things are going perfect. All right. Three bandages here and an adhesive bandage. I don't need that many. Most likely. Adhesive bandage. Put the alcohol wipes in here too. We have three bandages and a rip sheet. Probably don't need all that. If we're getting in, if we're getting into a situation where we have four injuries, we're probably more in a situation where we've been completely obliterated. So, a stale banana, fresh cooked bacon. Do you like some bacon? Let's eat the bacon. I don't really, really want any stale food. I just end up throwing that out somewhere. Read the cooking book. Fast speed. We're getting very bored and almost unhappy. We should probably do something. Like that. Looks like moving around also cancels the fast speed, so that's nice. Let's read a comic book to become less bored. Read the comic book. Quickly, though. Ah. Uh, no longer bored. There you go. Back to the cooking book. Bored of reading a book? We'll read another book. Yeah, we're getting get bored again. Mm -hmm. We're occupying ourselves with knowledge. Is that not good enough? It's apocalypse. Kind of getting bored of it. <laughs> Wild. Wild situations. Cooking! Nice to have nothing going on here. Some very good stuff. Getting hungry. Once we finish this book, we'll have a snack. Just generally dealing with stuff here. Do, 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 do. Book reading. So many pages. So many pages. Going through all this stuff definitely. I mean, we can also be. We can also fix our. I don't know if unhappiness. Instead of getting bored, eventually you become unhappy. I don't know if unhappiness will fix the boredom here by eating a muffin. We have half a burrito on us still. Yeah. Snack muffin. Not even enough. My goodness. Right, we finished reading the cooking book. That on the finished shelf here. More storage would be helpful, of course. Read a book at speed. And we still do want to deal with the overweight and out of shape business. Let me just get fitness up by doing running. <laughs> that also probably help. We don't want to be too hungry or anything, or we get lower weight we can carry, which is obviously not great. Definitely not what you want. If we're just sitting around the house here, we don't need to eat a ton or anything. We're getting slightly thirsty now and drowsy. So our bottle of water ran out of water. It's probably a good time to have the... Like random pots of water. That would do nicely. Alright, this book's done. So let me figure out if we can do anything like move the cooking pot of water into a bottle. Can we fill up the bottle here still? Got any water left in here? That's some at least. One, two, one, two. Doesn't seem to be working as a sink anymore. Really click on it. Yeah, whatever. Which wires in here? Barely any. Take the bottle there. We'll eat 
the rest of this burrito we have on us. Getting bored. Getting hungry. Getting tired. Still hungry. I don't want to go to bed hungry. Let's click on the fridge. Click boxes are sometimes a little bit much here. We'll have... I think we definitely, I mean, the stale food still does stuff, but it does make you bored and unhappy, so. Probably not ideal. Come out of water, let's go. Sleep. There we go. Getting hungry and asleep. Also getting bored still. Let's grab comic book comic book literature read and I think we discard this it also reduces stress and unhappiness we could more use this in situations where we're not just bored it seems like when we are out doing stuff we don't get as bored as quickly that's something to consider. Yeah, that just disappears entirely. Wild. Let's grab some more level one books here. We've got farming and foraging. We're still hungry. What else we got in here we could eat? A fresh pineapple. That also does thirst. That's a lot of pineapple. Let's eat half of a pineapple. We're just grabbing stuff out of here. Yeah, like a sh Farming could help. Get us more food. Could be an idea. Don't currently have like any seeds or anything. That's another thing to consider. Look at all these bars here. Lovely stuff. Multipliers, multipliers, multipliers. Still need the foraging book. We have that on this. We can read the rest of that. Nice to see all these bonuses ready to go. Should be a good time. Huh. Info. 67 zombie skill. We've definitely done better. There is a very... We only gotten injured a few times. So there is a possibility we would have survived. There's also a possibility we wouldn't have. So, eh. Reading books is just book reading time. Oh. Well, that is the helicopter. Sounds like it. Maybe we'll just be fine. Eat the rest of this pineapple. I don't really have a plan here. For the whole helicopter situation. Potentially lots of zombies coming through. Not really much we can do about that right now. If we had a plan together, we could have done something about that. Are they gone? I hope they're gone. I'm just going to read this book and hope for the best. Outside is not my problem right now. Oh, it's definitely moving around. Hungry again. Before we read all this book. Stale peanut butter jelly sandwich. Makes me more bored. Ugh. We're sort of more for thirst than anything. Or anything. We'll eat. A quarter of this patty. It's not like we're burning any extra calories here or anything. Prepare yourself for senior entertainment. Not right now. I got books to read. Hungry again. This old peckish. Yep, helicopter's still here. See if we can see if I guess we'll find out if we're gonna be able to put any of this knowledge to use here. If the outside is currently covered in zombies. That's why we have all these sheets up. So hopefully nothing comes in here. They can't see us. Everything should be fine. It's probably not going to be fine. 
That's why I have two doors to, to potentially be able to leave. I think. Yeah, if we tried to leave, though, that would also be obviously problematic. Let's grab something else to eat in here. Oh, yeah. Stale pork chops, stale steak, dang. Would not want to eat those for the unhappiness. Peanut butter jelly sandwich is also stale. This is also stale. Dang. We're running out of reasonable things in here. And grapefruit. Stale bananas. I don't want to be unhappy about things. We could start getting into the canned food. Have a beer. Yeah. That seems like a good plan. All things are completely falling apart here. <laughs> See if there's any actual effects. Only one beer. It was there for a second. That left. Oh, should be alright. Empty bottle. Yeah, it's a water container. Counts for something. Still a bit peckish. We'll eat. Half a grapefruit. Finish our book. Yes, we did. Okay. Oh, we're getting bored. And teacher becoming unhappy. Does literature count? I mean, I guess we should read the comic book again. Read the comic book. We're getting a little bit tired. We don't want to get bored and tired. Awareness reduced. Can't be having that. Where are all these bars? We'll have to see it. I think we have, probably, I think we have three more books to read. So, still more to do here. Yeah. You gotta find more entertainment and such, too. Right. Sleeping. Sleep. Yes. Do -do 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 -do. No problems. Everything's great. <laughs> Everything's going fine. Everything's going perfectly. Okay. Trapping volume one. Electrician volume one. And mechanics volume one will grab. It's been like, what, three full days of reading books? <laughs> We're not too happy about it, clearly. What if we have, like, reusable entertainment? So reading the comic books has been, like, one-time things. <laughs> We're apparently not one to go back through a series looking at everything again. <laughs> we are a one-and-done kind of person. In that regard. Well, that's okay. Maybe like some, like, other kinds of stuff. It'll be less boring once we finish reading all these books. I, mean, I guess there's also, like, the volume twos and stuff that we could read. We don't really need to worry about that just yet. And all this just reading is also cutting into our food situation. Stale food, no. Juice box, technically has some food. Eat some lard, that makes you really unhappy. <laughs> stale food, pops, stale strawberries, fresh zucchini, stale grapefruit. Eat the fresh zucchini. We got a lot of water in here. Like pops and stuff. Stale. I mean, technically it's still food, but it makes us unhappy and bored. We're already dealing with being bored right now. Probably not the most helpful. Another book. Electrician. Oh, yeah. Look at all these. Look at all these. It's only good for level two, though. Hopefully reading the higher level books... Doesn't like take longer or anything. It's slightly more pages, so that at least would be a situation. But beyond that, should be fine. Electrician. So I think we're still. We don't have a fishing book, I don't think. I think we also have a few like 
pamphlets and stuff that we could read for that kind of good stuff. Read a book, read a book, read a book, read a book. Looks like it's foggy outside. We can tell through the sheets here. Turn 20, turn 20, beautiful. Nutrition book, trapping book, have some food. In here is not stale, lard I guess, margarine. Stale, stale, stale. Fresh milk. It's got more in the thirst department than anything. We'll drink a bit of the milk here. Everything else seems to be getting stale here. Alright. I guess it is time to bust out the canned food. Grab a can opener. I guess also some like candy and stuff. It's not exactly great in the food department. Grab a can of beans. Open the canned beans. Just one of them. Canned bean fresh. Ah. What, what, you want me to cook the beans? Everything's make us unhappy. You are not easy to deal with here. We got an empty tin can now. Material? Potentially. We're gonna put water in that. It doesn't say. There's a possibility though. Let's store the cans in here. And bored and drowsy. We will sleep again. Might be a better plan to spread this process out slightly. Instead of just blasting through four days of reading. All in a row. But anyways, Mechanics Volume 1. We could read some of the Volume 2s here too. And a skill book we can read. Come to Volume 4. I think it needs to go into the other side here. Books, stuff. I think that's just the two things we have. Being bored again. Let's see if a newspaper. Makes us unboard. Let's do some boarding. Newspaper. Or make a newspaper hat. Well, that's fun. A little bit of boredom reduction and stress reduction. Now we have multiple newspapers. So presumably these are gonna be different newspapers. Every, every one we pick up. Because otherwise reading the newspaper once would kind of be the end of it. Because there's not exactly any new newspapers coming out these days. Read the newspaper, it's gone. Right. Mechanics Volume 1. Go for it. We've been here for four days. It's getting out of control. But we're ready. As ready as we're gonna be. At least to get to level 2. We do have a variety of level 2 books in here. So technically. We could get away with doing some more. I don't think we need to. Until we actually get level 2, I don't think it's really worth worrying about it. Could still try to go and get, try to make the whole list of which books we need. We still need Fishing 1. That's a main situation we need to worry about. Okay. Read a book, read a book, read a book. Let's see if we can find any canned food that we can just eat and not be unhappy about. That's also something to consider. I don't think reading this magazine will be slower. Metal walls and metal roofs. Well, technically we have the whole metalworking going here. That can help somewhat. Oh, yeah. That's definitely something. So I got fresh milk. 
I think that helped with the thirst situation. It's also good. We'll drink a bit more milk. How much milk is this? Not a huge amount. Don't want to just ch like chug a gallon of milk. That would be unhelpful, <laughs> to say the least. This is fresh still. Got that going for us. This shelf of things we don't really need is basically full. Shelf of things we don't need is full. Got it. All right, let's see if we can find something to eat here. How about some carrots? Can of oats, quite a bit. Open the can of carrots. There we go. Bit of hunger, bit of thirst. Not bad. We can't see how overly good things are going. Run around with a cooking pot of water. Seems a bit excessive. Pour into a cooking pot. There we go. Pour into water bottle. Perfect. We're feeling a little sad. <laughs> Not having a good time. Alright, that'll help with the water situation. I think cans of something. Find a way to increase your mood a little bit. How about some candy? That'll be a happy time. We're hungry. We're sad. What does it say makes us happier? Can I use 500? Open a candy package. I mean, open the candy package. Unhappiness, minus 10 for, and hunger, minus 2. Mint candy. We'll eat a mint candy. I guess a little happier. There we go. Are we also still bored, though? Do something about that here. Let's grab another newspaper. Apparently this is an interesting read. As if we haven't been reading enough already right now. Hilarious. So, certain cans are going to be better than others here. That much is pretty clear. That's okay. This is zero. That's exactly what we need this key ring for. That's okay. Your newspaper. A little bit less bored. That's alright. So this is 12 a.m. or 12 p.m. We got lollipops and stuff here. Maybe we'll put some of these away. We got some cans of something. We got pancake mix, baking soda. We probably actually need to make stuff with that. Can of oats has a good amount of calories in it. Beans we weren't happy about. Canned chili we probably want to again. Make that actually into food. Peaches could be good. All sorts of stuff in here. We got some cereal. That is a reasonable bit of food here. Let's eat a bit of cereal. Tasty. Okay. Yeah, that's enough food for carrying around. Let us see what the situation is here. Open the curtains. Looking fine. Open other curtains. It looks okay. Get some knowledge of stuff. Hmm. Alright, it's fine. I can just get bored. Alright, what do we want to do now? That's a zombie. Just hanging out on the ground here. How's our metal bar doing? Could be worse. There's like two zombies here. Probably. I'm going to approach from slightly further this way. Ready for you. Oh, there it is here. Must have snacked them down earlier. Not seeing any obvious horde or anything, so. That's a plus. I'll take it. We are looking good here. We can go do some stuff. What do we want to do? 
Open this up. There's still the generator over here, which I think we can now actually get, since we can disassemble stuff. Also, assemble stuff. Planks, nails, and levels in carpentry. We can make walls, pillars, well, kinda. Can't actually make any of that. We need two carpentry for quite a bit of this. Three of three for a door. Six for a double wooden door. Lots of stuff here. Bar element, bar counter, bookcase with five carpentry. If I need more carpentry to do much of anything there. Let's see if we can get some sprinting. This is actually giving us any sprinting XP. One. We might need to be near zombies. Which is inconvenient. We're still burning calories and everything. We're not bored since we are running around. Being able to run faster would be beneficial. Probably something to work on. Yeah, I'm not seeing a whole pile of zombies out here. Maybe they all just went past. You a zombie? That yeah, seems fine. Okay. Over in this section. Did you look at everything in here already? No, not really. Wasn't there like the survivor house right here that was being problematic? Because there was zombies inside and we didn't have a good escape plan. There's some zombies. Just, just a few. One zombie at a time here. Oh, two zombies at a time here. Eh, could be worse. about this house here. Anybody around? I don't like it. They had broken windows and stuff. There's zombies upstairs. We can look inside here. There's a zombie on the ground. I can dealt with that one. I kind of want to have an actual escape plan here. Well, that means clearing out the window doors here. Unbarricade. Using the hammer and stuff. Alright, there you go. Did we get a plank back for that? Yes, we did. Well, that's also nice. I like that. That'll be very helpful. I mean, that just means we can recycle the planks. There's also a huge win. On barricade. And if this door is locked, we can go inside the other way. Oh, something's breaking. Try to keep our weight down here while holding all the planks. There you go. Part of the duffel bag. These massive planks fitting in the duffel bags. And doors open. We're wielding the hammer here. Let's not do that. Quick primary metal bar here. That's how I do it anyways. Decent. Could be worse. Alright. We didn't get a chance to loot everything in here either. What with the whole zombies situation. They're still up here. One of them was, at least. There'd be another one here. 
There was at least three. Anybody else? Looking in the rooms. Looking around the corners. Exciting. <laughs> Not bored of this. My goodness. Okay. In here? Nope. In here, I got sheets everywhere too. Definitely not a bad house. We got more space, more supplies, and everything. Yeah, it looks like it's basically cleared out now. We did leave the door open. There's also all these open windows, so not like it really matters. Looking around, not really anything in there. Under the staircase? I don't think so. Downstairs bathroom. Broken window. Alright, we definitely need to deal with all the broken windows. That's that's not great. Do I want to deal with all the corpses in here too? Get those out of here. That'd be better. Don't really want corpses just inside. We might we might end up just moving into this house. It's a good spot. Alright. Corpse. We will drop that here. So we can see what's on the corpse. Nothing crazy. Let's just do that. That'd be a good thing to get accomplished here. And the neighborhood here is also pretty nice. What's on these guys? Another leather jacket. That's a solid item to have. Especially since it's leather. Clean that up, good. Leather is definitely more difficult to come by than other bits here. Some jeans. Same as ours. A key to something. I'll take a key to something. Extra metal bar in a good condition. Love that. A wallet. Some sneakers, long socks. Tank top. Sweater. Has some scratch resistance, but it's a sweater and be very warm. It's a bit bloody. I have options here. Put some stuff. Just store it in the fridge for now. All of our extra things we're dealing with. If we want to get the... We need to go get, like, the nails, essentially. In order to make use of all these planks here. All these in here. Got some fresh salami and fresh avocado. That could be good. It needs to be sliced before addition, addition to most recipes. here. Okay, let's put the bloody jacket in the fridge. Probably, probably not. Don't, don't put it with the food. Oh wow, look at all this stuff. I need like a clothing section here somewhere. Let's put it in here. I'm a bit tired. I don't want to sleep here just yet. That wouldn't be the best plan. What are these keys for? can't really move the corpses out while we're getting tired here. Let's drink a bit more milk. Slightly hungry, slightly drowsy. It's been a long day. Yeah, there's definitely lots to be had here. Then we can try moving some corpses out. Too tired here. Grab a corpse. Everything's also covered in blood. Which is not fantastic, obviously. Let's get out further here. Drop the corpse. It also looks like we can put the corpses in containers, so that's hilarious. Just just storing them for later. Maybe we could do something to clean up all the blood. 
Looks like there's also like scrap wood on the floor from when they broke the doors down. That also makes sense. Yeah, I think I like this house. It also has an upstairs and like more storage. Drop the corpse. What if these are ostensibly the survivors that were in here before? They definitely have broken windows though. I don't think just barricading, like, solves all your problems. But clearly, they didn't make it. I don't know. Let's deal with one thing at a time here. Drop this corpse. Right. Close the door, even though this not really solve our problems. Where's the zombie? We're getting a bit tired. Kind of want to deal with that right now. Any sprinting XP? There's seven. <laughs> we do need to, one, get better sprinting. Two, get better at Wait. Turn down a little bit. Just being hungry. You're burning calories. That works out. Just don't want any zombies following me right now. Preferably. We're gonna go sleep. And zombies following you while you're trying to go in somewhere safe to sleep. Not the best strategy, obviously. Okay. Seals are going ready to be used. Definitely looks like more carpentry would be beneficial. We get some of that by barricading stuff again. Close the curtains. Good night. I don't think it's really late or anything. We could just do some light carpentry. While we wait around for a little bit. Have some cereal. Disassemble the neighborhood. Disassemble, disassemble object. Using our hammer. Can we speed up disassembly? Yes, we can. Disassemble, disassemble object. Keep on getting some garbage on the floor here. Yeah, there's some nails. I'll take a nail. It's also going to be giving carpentry XP. Up to 21 XP into level 2 here. And disassemble, disassemble guy. You're a little bit tired. Still no zombies around though. We've mostly done a good job in that front. I think this is enough disassembled here. Grab plank and the nail here that should be good okay reduced awareness is not something we want though obviously counterproductive to living <laughs> go to sleep okay well that solves that we can get some kind of grill or something. We could also possibly cook some stuff. Wow, we were awake really early. I guess we could see if the stove is still working. Yeah, various problems here. Anyways, let's re equip the bar here. Got some stuff in the bag. I think we'll try moving over to the other house. It's just got a lot more space. And two floors, better like walls and stuff. But I think we're going to need some help with moving all of our stuff. Because we got a lot of stuff here we might want to take with us. And we are, in fact, a burglar. So we might be able to get some vehicle action going. Next time.
Goodbye.